everyone and welcome back to another Wrestlemania 36 tier season 6 WWE Supercard video today just wanted to start off the video by saying uh, there is history being made in the game as Women's Giants Unleashed is the first of its kind uh, starting tomorrow and Nikki Bella headlines it bit of a uh, strange choice but probably because she's got a new book out and um was going into the hall of fame with with brie but really thought they would have uh chosen someone in like the current uh times really that's that's still active and wrestling plenty uh could be chosen for it as uh, there's a lot of uh, good up and coming female wrestlers at the moment, but Nikki Bella has got it. Not complaining. Will be a very strong card to get if you can get it. Also, uh, just before we get into the video as well, just a couple of people: Cool Connor and I think I'm going to say this right, Nashed, uh, Nashed. Uh, have asked for shout outs there you go if anyone else is looking for a shout out then feel free to message me and i will give you a shout out on a video now the store has just updated uh, i've got my tbg rewards in just over half an hour got a couple of uh, rewards from me uh, pvp as well We'll just claim those first. I got four momentums again. Nothing from these. Oh, Ric Flair. That's a that's the first one. And second one, Platinum League pack. Nothing from them. Just training cards. Also, um, want to show you guys this as uh, I was really really pleased it has got equipment on but he is now finished and there we have Christian which is fantastic to have was really pleased uh, that I could get Christian his stats are obviously tweaked a little bit because um, I've got the equipment on the wrestlemania 36 equipment if i remove that a second those are his uh, stats decent card hopefully we can uh, build on that see what uh, what else we can get during this event and um you never know i don't know if i'm going for natalia i think she's gonna be too expensive to get a pro of a single definitely could be on the cards but a single's not really going to do anything to my deck it's not it, it it would go into my deck but i'm just thinking long term if i can have either or if i could get a pro then yeah fair enough i'd, I'd love a pro of natalia uh, otherwise if I could just get one more card I'd just go for the F1 Christian but we'll see what happens anyway um, War is the new game mode as well um, that replaced the Elimination Chamber on target for the finals at the moment not quite the championship but the finals in King of the Ring we'll see how that uh, that rolls out hopefully we can get into another championship and get another one of those victories we will see um i also got rid of keith lee um to rank up christian i've got a couple of pros working on the go at the moment the f1 of um carl rowley as well is another one I'm working on as uh, the 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 Keith Lee and the um, Montez Ford I sacrificed for training up cards as 
they're pretty weak. Kyle O'Reilly isn't the best, but I'd rather with him with having an F1 over the Keith Lee when they were both left arrows, then only one of them can be in the deck and the F1 might as well. So I let uh, Keith Lee go. And that is pretty much it on the news on the WrestleMania side. We're going to jump into the story at the minute. Also, there seems to be quite a bit of um, news occurring. Well, circulating, should I say, about Roman Reigns at the moment. They've been taking him out of uh, erasing him from like the raw episodes with the build up to WrestleMania. Um, bit of a strange one. A guy that the put so much behind to push and push and push as much as a lot of people didn't like him. Some people do, more don't. Um, and but with the current situation and stuff that's going on in the world, he put his family first. Just had um, his wife pregnant with a couple of twins as well, so you can understand that sort of situation. It's it's a difficult one, uh, but they're seeming to be erasing him from quite a lot of stuff at the moment. We will see how that uh, pans out soon. Maybe he might feel be a bit of grudged, and you never know. Maybe down the line he could ask for his release. Who knows? It's strange times at the minute with a lot of things going on, and then the revival now called, uh, I think they called the Revolt looking very much like they're going to AEW so a lot of things happening in the world at the moment in the wrestling uh, world so we'll see what uh, what happens now there's a few new packs in the store at the moment this is climbing the ladder and overseas action again I'm going to do these um, overseas action as I want these deltas which will take me to 700, uh, 1400, 1750, I think it is, that we'll get from these. Um, possible rewards contain seven of the following. Not expecting anything great from these. We're starting at uh, SummerSlam 18, but let's get in and get these opened. We did get some luck with these before and the other ones with the Carlo Rallies. Hopefully we can get something decent, but we will see. First pack then. We've got a Royal Rumble, so not too bad here, Jay Styles. Second one. Anything decent? Nightmare. These are already better value than those ones that did the other day them top 10 ones those were absolutely horrendous 1500 credits 15,000 credits and we didn't even get anything decent in them really they were they were bad next one vanguard nightmare These packs are probably um, good for if you are thinking of opening packs. People who are lower tiers, if you've got enough credits and you're looking at packs, these could pop. Ooh. <laughs> Sports are a bit too soon on that one, but um, in general, these packs aren't too bad for the value wise. But that previous one was the worst one. That we've had so far with Gallows last time that he will be in this game that's them done we are also I, I am not doing these men's division pairs now let's just put this in perspective right men's division pairs now the men's cards are always more expensive than the women's cards we've always had had that it's 
always seem to be the case like 4950 there you go just compare those packs but yeah in the pack store yesterday the women's tag team packs again from shattered were 1750 1750 credits yet these are 1500 credits Where's the logic in that? Just throw that out there. You guys decide, but uh, to me, they do like to, if if you don't pay that much attention to the store, they do like to try and have people's pants down. So just be careful when you're looking for stuff on here. First of all, I'm not quite sure what we can get out of the end result of these. We'll just play it by ear and see what is what. Starting from SS18 again to um, WrestleMania 36. I'd imagine that the last pack you will either get a female or a male WrestleMania 36. That's my guess at this point as it being um, sort of money in the bank themed pack type. But uh, the 1 to 10, like the ones that we've done before. Let's see what we can get out of these. The first pack giving you the oh well it was giving you the scrambler sign but couldn't use it anyway uh second one again moves up now gothic to wrestlemania 36 nightmare third pack is free which Thing of these, yeah, the money in the bank ones. Money in the bank cards. Let's see what we can get. I think that is a pro. Pretty sure I had that previously. Next one. Support this time of a superstar. Steve Cutler. And again, support with one. Drake Maverick, another one that's going. Asuka. One thing I've noticed as well is... Um, when you're doing your picks on the draft board, I don't know if it's the same for you guys, but when you're getting your resets, a lot of these resets I'm getting, superstars that uh, have left, but are, that are going to be phased out of the game, like um, Kurt Hawkins, Zack Ryder, um, Curtis Axel, Luke Gallows, Carl Anderson, those sort of resets. I presume they might be doing them more as like a reset just to try, if you are collecting cards for the stars and stuff, just to give you a chance to probe them for the catalogue before they obviously don't make any more cards. I don't know. That's just my theory. Whether that's happening the same to you guys, I don't know. Let me know. Here we go, so the six pack is another three pack and the deltas. Oh Shinsuke. That one is a new one, I haven't had that one before. Seventh pack. Manager, double stack manager. Unfortunately, I've already got that, so it's no use to me. But if you guys were getting one of them, I'm sure it'd be of use to you. Um, again, a chance of... It's like a prop, I think, these tat Yeah, support. Coffee Kingston, pretty sure of it. Yep, had that before. Nine. 
Ah, the Hell in the Cell ones. I really want the Fiend. I'd love to get the Fiend. Come on, give me the Fiend. Oh, it's a WrestleMania. Brock Lesnar. Okay. Last one. Poss oh. Okay. There's a chance of... So they roll the money in the bank ones. Okay. Oh, it's from Vanguard as well. Royal Rumble. WrestleMania 36. You do have a chance of a John Cena or the Fiend. WrestleMania 36. This is a surprise. If I could get a WrestleMania 36 from these. I haven't had one of these. Then that would be. Very very good. Ideally I'd want the Fiend. John Cena is the strongest of the two. Wonder what the odds are. Let's find out. Three, two, one, boom. Vanguard. Well, on the positive side, it is a new card. Alistair Black. Okay. Bit gutted on that, to be honest with you. Um, let's do it again I think I've got enough to do it again Just skipping through the normal ones That aren't uh, Any good I think this could be a new card Yes I like that, especially with the title image as well. He's also supposed to be returning uh, to Raw. Wonder how they go about doing that. Whether he's going to still be a heel or whether he comes back as a face. Braun Strowman, I think that's a new one as well. Oh, no, no. I've had a pro of that before. Next one. Delta again. That is a pro, pretty sure. Oh, it's the black. I already had that. Wesley Blake, pretty, yep. Yeah. Love the Fiend, give me a Fiend. Cataclysm, again, I think is a new card. Uh, Ricochet, pretty sure we will we'll check these. Now, again, moment of truth. Can we get a WrestleMania 36? If it's anything like the last one, which was a Vanguard, again, new card. Not too disappointed, but would really, really like one of these. I want that Fiend image. I don't really play Money in the Bank much. I'm playing it a little bit just for the chance to see if any of these rewards come up in Money in the Bank. Um, not rewards. Uh, purchases for like the... Alpha, Delta, Omega, but let's find out. Oh, Vanguard again. Could be a pro, though. No. <laughs> Murphy's Law. That is pretty much my expression at the moment. Why? Why couldn't it give me the Fiend? But uh, never mind. As I say, you've got to be in it to win it. But still, 
nice uh they are they are quite good packs them. i do enjoy opening them up just a shame that we've got vanguards out of both of them would have been really good to get something else out of them let's just check uh the collectible side of things hmm have a chance of doing a bit on Natalia if needed but like I say I'd rather have the chance of getting a pro if I can get a pro but we'll see also with this Giants let's just have a quick look in here first um, Well, what's this all starter pack don't know why it does this it does this every time again nothing that uh, that is of use it's actually waiting on network which is always a pain now rewards let's have a look milestone oh Lacey Evans she will be a pro Okay, Maurice, Beth Phoenix, it should be an F1. It's going to be interesting though on these to see how, uh, well the points are pretty much going to be the same, I would have thought. Uh, don't forget this isn't a flash event, this is normal event, so it would be three and a half days. It does say about getting the Omega Alpha Delta off uh, from these reward from as you progress. Not sure how many we will find out. Um, but yeah, that is pretty much it on that side of things. Let's just see. Let's just check combinables. Um, AJ, he was a combinable. Get rid of that one. Adam Cole, already done again. Yes, she was a pro. We'll be able to see what this animation does now. Not bad. Any others? No, not really. Um, and then the vanguards I think we did lock yes we'll lock those and get rid of the rest of these and that is yeah so that, that pretty much is it if you guys do these climbing the ladder packs let me know if you guys manage to get anything decent from them Hopefully you'll get uh, WrestleMania 36 from them and not the Vanguard like I did, but or Royal Rumble if the Royal Rumble benefits you, whichever. But if uh, you have been saving your credits from climbing tiers as well, these usually are good packs to uh, get something good out of. Unfortunately, we didn't get anything from these this time but the induction ones that we have done previously i've had some wrestlemanias out of those and i'm sure you guys will get a bit of luck if you do these packs and if you're playing women's giants unleashed good luck with that hopefully you get uh, the event card if you're going for the event card and that is that is it so thank you again. If you are new to the channel, please do uh, subscribe. Drop us a thumbs up if you like what you see and wanting to see more of this sort of content. And until next time, take care of yourself and peace out.